Welcome back to Suburban Living. We're going to do a little work today with this Suburban 15 tractor. I don't know what you guys do who have a Suburban tractor, but I typically keep a chain, uh, typically a half inch, 9 sixteenths, 5 eighths, pair of pliers, screwdriver, etc. in that toolbox. Today I'm going to use this chain to pull out these, these bushes. Well, I'm going to attempt to. Some of these bushes are pulled out kind of easily. These are a type of a lilac, although you see this uh, this uh, evasive vine that's all wrapped around these. And here's a pile of tires in the way. And then here's this vine right here. So what I'm going to attempt to do is wrap the chain around it, put it in low range, and just see if I can't just pull them out without uh, doing a lot of yanking on them. Thought it'd be good to see these little tractors do a little bit of work. Now this tractor has no chains on the tires. They are loaded though. No wheel weights. We'll see what we can do. I'll, I'll hook it up as close as I can to the base. And then one time when I bought a tractor, this was on it and I just kept it and I, I like it. I know it's a little unhandy because it has to be bolted on, but uh, it's a lot better than trying to use the hitch and some type of a drawbar, in my opinion. All right, guys, what happened? It didn't work, that's what happened. I don't know if I didn't have my chain down low enough, but it just broke the tops off of a lot of those. Slipped right over, broke the tops off, probably not, not tight enough. I'm gonna try the other bush, and we'll see if I do any better on it. good news guys while the camera was off I hooked the sears back up to it and pulled it out pulled the other one out too right over here all kinds of vines here really mess this up anyway just completely sears the sears tractor completely pulled those out so see guys you can use these little tractors for good work Just cut that right off, right flush. Okay guys, if at first you don't succeed, you gotta be a big enough man to admit that sometimes it takes another tool. I probably could have hooked my Jeep up to these plants, these bushes, but I didn't feel like getting it back here and yanking around on them, figured I'd just cut them off. I'm gonna put a compost pile right over here, clean this up this year. All right guys, thank you for tuning in. Appreciate uh, your views. You have a great day.